Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sorry, and welcome back to Last Under Survival. So hopefully today is finally the day when we're gonna start working on our minivan, as the only thing that's left for us is to finish building these uh, this wall, and all we need is just two of those iron wires, and we can get them from the farm location, so hopefully we are gonna get those iron wires, as you don't always get them, but after we get them, and from what you guys told me, then we should be able to go to the sewer location, then we'll be able to start getting those asbestos, right? And at the same time, uh, we are going, we're gonna unlock the highway and from that highway, we should be able to start getting spark plugs, right? Without any further ado, let's get back to the base now. Let's fast travel there and let's get enough weapons and let's go to that farm location. Plus today we have some sort of a special event at the farm location where we do 30% more damage with a skull crusher. So I don't know, maybe I'm going to take a skull crusher there just for the memes, but we don't really use that skull crusher there that often. Doesn't really matter. I just want to go to the farm location. I want to get my iron wires. Hopefully we'll get them. If I don't get them, I'll be very sad. And yeah, because we have lots of things planned today and everything revolves around me finding those iron wires. So hopefully we'll get them now. Welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome everybody. Glad to see you all over here. And if you're watching this live stream after it's over, then head to the pinned comments down below. There are going to be timestamps and you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker. So let's continue getting the things here. Let's continue getting the shotguns and the glocks. There we go. Let's take those. What else do we need? We actually don't probably need anything else for that farm location. We already have way too many weapons. There we go. Whatever. I'm just going to drop these things here-ish. Let's get another stack of uh, first aid kits. Let's get some healing items. And let's go, ladies and gentlemen. What are you going to do, Sayak? I'll literally just explain what are we going to do. But Sayak, I... I I didn't understand. Well, as I said, we are going to be building. We are going to be getting those iron wires, and hopefully, we'll start. We'll start working on the minivan. So that's what we're going to do. Get the stupid skull crusher, says the Labares. Yes, indeed, that's what I've taken. Welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. They say katana. Wait, do we still need the katana for the special event? Because I've checked that you need the skull crusher. But do you still need to do damage with a katana or with a skull crusher? Deal damage with a skull crusher, so we don't need to do it with a katana. We need to do it with a skull crusher. All right, let's get to the farm, guys. And I, hopefully we will get those uh, iron wires. Is the highway open? The highway is going to be open after we assemble the wall. And yeah, we are going now to the farm location just to get those iron wires so that we can start assembling that wall. And we can start getting asbestos from the sewers and we can start getting those uh, spark plugs from the highway. How are you on this actual Friday, says Leadbike? I'm doing great. Hopefully you're doing great as well. Welcome to the stream. And yes, indeed, guys, it is Friday. It's not some little Friday. It's not nano Friday, so it's not Wednesday. It is, guys, Friday. All right, how much damage we do? We do 57 damage. I guess that's pretty decent. Probably. What if you get zero wires? Change the title. Yeah, that's it. We'll have to change the title and I'll have to change the thumbnail. But hey, hopefully we get those iron wires. If I don't get them, that's it, guys. Everything's going to be said. Everything will be said. I'm really hoping for the, for the iron wires. All right, the rotten yokel, let's pop him. Actually, we do over 100, uh, over 90 damage with the skull crusher after we get a crit shot. Pretty decent, if you ask me. All right, no blue boxes there. Let's get these raiders. All right, got him. I'm pretty certain a lot of you have already gotten all of those things. You have already finished the wall. So I don't think I'm the only one who's gonna do it today. Some of you have probably done that already yesterday. I need eight more wires for the wall. I've been getting six every time the farm resets. Hope that continues. Well, good luck with that. The farm location once did not give me those uh, wires, so hopefully. The history isn't going to repeat itself today. I want my wires, and that's it, ladies and gentlemen. I'll be very happy if I get them, but to be honest, I'm like 40% certain that we won't get those iron wires today because that's that's something that the game would do. Just to mess up with me. 
Uh, kill revengers at the farm. All right, so we need to kill only one revenger. We don't need to kill any bulls for some reason. Okay. Has the live stream just started? Yes, the live stream has just started. So yeah, this game want to mess with me. All right, there we go, guys. There's the Revenger. So let's try to fight him with the Skull Crushers. You can find gasoline at Bunker If I only find 11 gasoline when I do. Says Tigano. Well, congrats on the gasoline, I guess. That's awesome. Well, maybe I'll be able to do two hits instead of one. Well, we can't do one. All right, we can barely do two hits. Is it? No, we cannot do two hits. We cannot do two hits all the time. As then the cooldown is a little bit too long. There we go. We need to wait for the cooldown one. Okay, couldn't do it. Well, gonna be pretty hard to do it now. All right, let's wait for until he spits again. All right, the cooldown's getting higher and higher. Couldn't do another shot. All right, let's wait. You know what? The skull crusher isn't that bad. Especially when it does 100 and something damage. That's when it gets awesome. There goes 64 damage. 109 damage. Alright, and one more attack and that is it ladies and gentlemen. We have dealt with this guy. We have dealt with the Revenger. Let's get the... Pieces of cloth. Let's craft those bandages. Let's get the weapon. And the blue box has got to be here because we've heard it do the tung. Probably raiders moved it. There we go. The blue box is over here. So what I can do is probably just drop it here. There we go. Now let's go, guys. Let's loot the farm. Please tell me we're going to get those iron wires there. If I don't get them, I'll be very sad. I'll be very upset. I'm going to delete the game. And I'm going to flying, guys. If we don't get those wires today, I mean, that's fine. We'll do some raids. We're just going to cry in the corner. We'll just cry in the corner. Maybe I'll try to auto-clear the farm location, but I doubt that we'll get anything from auto-clearing it. As that'll be very sad. Oh no, I don't even know why I started fighting this infected bull. Oh, let's get the guy and the raiders. There we go. Got him. Go on, guys. That's it. Here, we can get those iron wires. Please. Please, please. We're going to loot the other room first. To build up the suspense. I'm going to get hit in the face by that savage eye. Nope, we did not get hit in the face. All right, let's loot these two chests. And then we have third chest to open up. And Kaylee, thanks for the super chat. The spare parts for the van? By the way, keep up the lives. Love, M. Kaylee, smile, thanks for smile. the thanks for the super chat. Really appreciate that. Welcome to the stream. And where to find spare parts for the minivan? Uh, you can get them after you assemble the wall at the settlement. And after you assemble the wall, I assume you'll get some sort of special tasks. And then you will unlock the highway at the gas station. And from that highway, you should be able to get those uh, spark plugs. At least that's what people told me. And that's how it kind of worked in the past. So hopefully that's going to happen. Please tell me we've gotten... Yes, guys, we've gotten the wires. That's it. We've gotten six of those iron wires. We can assemble the wall. We can start getting the asbestos and we can start getting the iron wires. That's uh, the, the spark plugs. This is awesome, ladies and gentlemen. This is epic. I'm actually happy. I'm actually happy. I'm more happy about this than I would have gotten a purple machete blueprint. Like, I would seriously rather get those iron wires today than, than get the purple blueprint. I'd rather never get that purple machete blueprint. But I wanted to get those iron wires. Let's it up. Wait, wait, wait. We haven't opened up the blue box yet. Let's open it up. I'm very happy. Everything's awesome. Any new horror games content? I don't know. I don't think... Nothing comes out. The saddest part is that they've delayed Sons of the Forest. So the... The Forest too. So that's that's kind of sad. We forgot the blue box. Yeah, from happiness I forgot in the blue box. So we're gonna open up that blue box here right now. 
And yeah, guys, Sons of the Forest game got delayed again till February 2023. Which is a little bit sad. It was supposed to come out in October. But it's not coming out in October. Kind of disappointed. But uh, 2023 is supposed to be full of games. Lots of games are coming out in 2023. Alright, let's get these guys. And there are only two Savage Giants. I usually avoid them. But this was a pretty lucky farm location spawn. Like, there weren't lots of those Savage Giants. So we can just deal with them and that's it. Backflip to sell. Oh, wow, they're actually more rotten yolk. Uh, Savage Giants. So, yeah, guys, no backflips. The backflips are gone. We don't do backflips anymore. Backflips are over. Backflips are history. Robert Allen, thanks for being a member. Thanks, Robert Allen. Thanks for smashing the join button. Welcome to the stream, mate. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Boo says Scaly. Don't boo me. The the backflips are over. Backflips were just a dream. Backflips are never coming back, guys. That's it. Now let's run to the top. Let's try to open up that blue box and hopefully we will get a... I mean, purple machete blueprint. Why not? We've gotten the wires. I might as well get that purple blueprint as well. I mean, why not get all the good things at uh, once? And we have gotten... Oh, no. We've gotten a Diablo blueprint for the... For the saw blade, which is something. But not something that we need. All right. That's it. Let's leave this place. Let's check this place. If it has a puppy. Well, sadly, it doesn't have a puppy. So let's leave it. Let's skedaddle from that place. But saying there was a puppy! No, guys, there was not a puppy. Don't lie to me. Why do you like to lie? Why you, why you have to be like that, guys? Why do you have to be a bunch of liars? There were zero puppies. Alright, now let's get back to the base. And we have to get ready. We're gonna get a new armor, we're gonna get new weapons, and then we're gonna go to the settlement. We're gonna drop those iron wires, and we're gonna finish building that wall, as I'm pretty certain we'll get some sort of new tasks. Rico says, no, you just ignored the poppy. That's a lie. Zach, that was Corgi. That was no one there. All right, let's get the helmet. And let's get ready. Cat in the box emote. I didn't even know an emote like that exists. All right, that's epic. <laughs> Cat in the box, or that's a doggo in the box. All right, so the only thing that we need to do is to kind of sort out this inventory because, as I said, probably as soon as we drop those uh, iron wires, we will get the some sort of a new event going. So I have to be ready for it. We have to be prepared. We have to have clean clothes. Let's drop this, let's drop the Skull Crushers and Cage Con, thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Let's drop these M16s and shotguns. And one red ticket. Let's also switch the armor. I'll probably get a few more, maybe some melee weapons, some guns some I don't know what there we go let's get this let's get I just need two iron wires so the rest are gonna stay in a different chest here probably there we go that's better let's eat some carrots Let's get a melee weapon. So I can eat 10 days to finish the minivan. I mean, we don't have to finish the minivan today. I don't want to finish it today anyways. I just want to unlock it. There is, we will unlock two new items. Not only the asbestos, but the spark plugs as well. So we will unlock two things at the same time. Is 
Is there anything else that I can take? All of these guns are unmodded, whatever. Let's take another M16. That should be more than enough items for whatever is about to happen, as I have no idea what's gonna happen. I just know what things we're gonna unlock, because you guys already spoiled me everything. Alright, now let's go, guys, to the new base. Let's drop those wires and let's start it. I think the first run gives you two spark plugs. Yes, indeed, you can probably get two spark plugs. Some of you maybe said you get two spark plugs each run. Maybe. But we'll see. And also, we don't even know if those spark plugs are going to be guaranteed. Maybe sometimes you won't get them. So let's, guys, finish the, the wall here. Let's go. Let's drop it here. Let's finalize it. That's it. We have finished the wall. So something must have happened. Let's go here. Let's open this up. And there we go. Let's get the rewards. And now the fifth task, uh, the fifth task, toxic water. Connor wants to finish the garage. I don't know why he needs it so urgently, but fine, I'll help. Wait, don't tell me that we're, where's the thing? Where's Connor? There go, there's the guy. There we go, the settlement is safe now. We can get back to work, no one will bother us anymore. Uh, now we need asbestos. Uh, I'm sure there's plenty in the sewers, will you check? So let's go to the port, but we're not going to get 20 asbestos. Maybe you guys lied to me, but we, maybe we won't get those spark plugs right now. If you lied to me, guys, I will drop kick you. Because I was excited for the spark plugs. Well, in any case, at least we have unlocked the asbestos. That is something. Let's go now to the port. I mean, I have enough items to go to the port location, don't I? Um, maybe let's get back to the base. Let's get another weapon and then we'll go to the port. I think that'll be a bit better. It is true. You can get after the sewers. All right, we'll go there after the sewers then. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You need to do that mission too. Okay, let's do it then. So maybe you guys didn't lie to me. Maybe you are not liars. Uh, I clock you. Thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. And I'll get a minigun. There we go. That should be good enough. Change the stream name. I mean, we still are getting the minivan spark plugs. And uh, Robert Allen, thanks for the super chat. It's a spets US since Matthew isn't correcting you. It's a spesta since Matthew isn't correcting it. Wait, Robert Allen, thanks for the super chat. Wait, have I been mispronouncing asbestos all the time? Again, I have no idea how does one... I don't think I've ever heard the um, asbestos. 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 It's... Asbestos. Asbestos. It's almost... I said usually asbestos, and it's asbestos. Okay, cool. So it's not O's, it's us. Okay, cool. Thanks, Robert Allen, for the information. <laughs> I've been mispronouncing it all the time. Very epic. Thanks, Robert Allen. And Jane Adden, thanks for the super chat. Hello, Sarek. Today, I got two spark plugs in one run. Very nice. Thanks, Jane Adden, for the super chat. Hopefully, we're going to get those spark plugs as well. Congrats on your spark plugs, and hopefully, we'll get more spark plugs in the future. Asbestos. Okay, so guys, it's asbestos, not asbestos. Uh, the port location. Let's go now to the port. Let's do it. And we will get the asbestos. That music disc is broken or something. If you put it in, you need to go to the settings and turn on the, the music. And then you should be able to hear it. Uh, talk to Connor. Okay, we gotta go here. Go down the sewer. Let's go. Here. We're gonna go in the sewer. Let's go. And Ahmed Mahim, thanks for the super chat. I love you. What is the best way to get the spread chat? Thanks, mate, for the super chat. And the best way to get the spread chat is to open up purple blueprints. <laughs> and that's not really much of a tip and trick because it's pretty hard to get that spread chat. It is random. There is no guaranteed way to get that spread chat. So you just clear 
the police department, you get a bunch of blue cards, you exchange them for purple, which is not really that efficient, and you keep your fingers crossed that you'll get lucky enough to get a spread shot, but you don't really get it for sure. There's no guaranteed way to get that spread shot. It's all uh, random. So hopefully that answers your question. All right, let's get these swamp bloaters. Find asbestos. Well, let's find guys the asbestos then. I'm curious, where can they be located? Okay, at the very end, maybe we don't even have to go to the second floor to find them. Uh, let's get the auto mode, let's get the sneaking. What ifs? I'm curious, how many of them we get per run? Do we get 20 of them, like an entire... An entire stack of those asbestos, maybe. Alright, we still cannot go to the other floor here, so apparently there will be another ladder somewhere further. I got four, got 12 asbestos and six spark plugs so far. Wow, how on earth did you get so many things already? That is nuts, and that is awesome. All right, we're gonna loot all of these chests. I'm not gonna stop and rest until we loot all of those chests. You don't even have to clear the whole sewers. Yes, I know that we don't have to clear the whole sewers. I mean, it's literally pointing us where to go, but I wanna clear it fully to, to triple, quadruple check everything. Plus, we don't really go to these sewers that often. So we might as well just check it out. Psych, like, where can I get Pete except the swamp location? Where can you get Pete? Like, I mean, there's no guaranteed way to get Pete. Sometimes you'll get it from... Uh, in the season pass, I guess. And that's it. Like, you don't really get peat. Wait, all of those things are... Collapsed. So, I don't get it. How are we gonna go higher? Maybe this thing isn't collapsed. No, this thing is collapsed as well. All those ladders are destroyed. What's going on? Maybe it's because of this event. So, we cannot even go to the second floor now. Missed a spark plug in the second room. What do you mean, missed a spark plug? I've literally checked every room. I did not miss a single room here. Let's get this, let's get some glass. Haven't gotten any spark plugs from the highway. Okay. Hopefully, we'll have a bit better luck. There we go. This ladder is collapsed as well. What's a bullcrap? That's all I can say about it. Let's open this door up. They're trolling. Yeah, probably everything's collapsed just for this event. And after that, everything's going to be open as well. Everything's going to be open later. Wait, can I hide here and fight them? Behind this wall. Maybe they can come a bit closer. Alright, let's quickly... There's the Berserker. I want to deal with the Swamp Loader first. There we go. The Swamp Loader is dead. Now we can easily deal with this Berserker because he does lots of damage and he punches kind of fast. So you attack him when he's doing jumps or whatever. It's not the best door to wall check because you don't really see what he's doing. It is better to wall check probably with another door. I just wanted to try this door out as I've never wall checked them on this door. But this door seems to work as well. It's kind of a thick door.
There go a few more shots. And there we go. We dealt with the Berserker. I love you 300 how you give tips and tricks. I play the same way. And I am in 114 level. Thanks for all. Hey, Ahmed Magin, thanks for the super chat. I'm glad that you're enjoying the live streams. I'm glad that you're enjoying the tips and tricks. Thanks for being here, mate. Thanks for everything. And we've gotten, ladies and gentlemen, we've gotten four asbestos. This is epic. This is 50 kilos. So we've gotten four bags. That's 200 kilos. That's about like 480 pounds, probably. Nice. Go in my backpack. Let's get that acid as well. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's return back to the settlement. And let's talk to Connor. Let's see what Connor's going to tell us. So we didn't even have to clear the entire sewer location. I was ready to go to the second floor. But apparently we didn't even have to do that. I have played highway, but I couldn't even search the car where you can get the spark plug. So it's bugged for me. Am I the only one, says uh, Goga? Uh, I mean, we'll check it out. Hopefully it doesn't bug for us. But if it's bugged for you, then maybe you need to contact support. Uh, or maybe wait until it resets and you'll be able to do it again. I don't know. So, guys, let's get back to the settlement. After giving us bestus, you'll... He'll send you to highway. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's now run, not to the pine bushes, but to the settlement right away. Also, while we are running, we can check out the calendar. We have gotten the Crooked Creek Farm event. We have this big hunt event, which is... Kind of lame, in my opinion, probably one of the worst events in the game. And we have the Gold Rush. One of my favorite events in the game. One of your favorite events in the game, guys. I wish every single event was like the Gold Rush event. Seriously, one of the best events imaginable. Alright, there's Connor just floating. Almost floating. He's kind of sitting, but kind of floating. Whatever, let's talk to Connor. Great, we have asbestos. Now, that's not the priority now. What is the priority? The minivan won't start. We have no spark plugs. Ask uh, around the gas station. Maybe they know something. I, I assume that's what he said. All right, let's go here. Let's go to act two. And uh, Connor wants to finish the garage. I mean, we've just finished it. I didn't think it's going to happen so quickly. I don't even remember finishing six tasks. Whatever, let's get that, and now we can finish the last mission. The last push is fixing the minivan. Connor is counting on the car. He'll need it when his friends come back. Ooh, guys, so at least we know now what's up. It's kind of our vehicle, but at the same time, it is not our house. Does it make sense? It's like we're not doing it all for ourselves. Like, it's like a community. It's like a settlement. So it's not our second base, even though it's kind of a second base, but... We are building a minivan for his friends, not for ourselves. So it is what it is. But in any case, guys, let's go to the gas station. Wait, before we do this, let's drop those asbestos in this thing. Bam, we need 16 more. Do we have enough weapons for the highway? Probably we have enough of that stuff. So now let's guys run to the highway. Finally, we are going to unlock something new, something epic. We already unlocked the asbestos today. It's always fun to unlock new things. I'm not going to lie. Well, we guys, we got the rest stop event. The, the highway is going to wait for us. Can't miss the rest stop event as we get some free weapons. The settlement is actually the commune. Says Lila Barros, maybe. It is somewhat of a community event for us because there are lots of people in our settlement. But hey, I'm just curious what that settlement is going to be all about. Because hey, obviously we are building that minivan. We are building those other buildings. But what's the point of them? Like, obviously they'll have to add something to the game. And they said that they will add something. In the future, then we're gonna get like lots of permanent content in the fall. So in the next few months, guys. Like during these three months, then we should get something awesome. Some permanent content and I'm very excited about it. Super excited about it. Let's 
scratch uh, that stuff and let's go. Let's start looting the choppers. This, I don't, don't need the yellow ticket. So I can be live stream contact support for the bunker Charlie. I don't understand what that means. The bunker Charlie is not in the game. Let's do another spread shot on these guys. And let's loot now the last chopper here. Nothing here, nothing here. It's all right. We still have probably gotten at least one weapon from this place. So that is something. Also, let's get the nails because we are running kind of low-ish on nails. The settlement will actually be a rest stop event in a parallel, parallel, parallel universe. Where the player questions the morality of slaughtering you for fun. The last day on Earth in the multiverse. Last day in the multiverse. There we go, guys. Now let's go to the gas station. Take the katana. I didn't see the katana. If there was a katana, then that's sad. But not really that big of a deal. It's like, why did you leave the katana? We didn't really need it, but I, first of all, didn't really see it. It didn't click in my head. But even if it clicked in my head, doesn't it's not really that big of a deal. We don't need the katana. But we could have taken it, but it's fine. It's like, what about Miss Survival live streams? There will be Miss Survival videos. There won't be Miss Survival live streams. Because as soon as we do one Miss Survival live stream, there will be no more content left in Miss Survival. Like, Miss Survival is a cool game, but it doesn't have a lot of content. Like, we are already almost done with Miss Survival, as the map isn't that huge. The loot doesn't respawn. You can respawn the loot yourself, but it's not going to be super fun to reload it again. And if I'm going to do just one live stream where we play for like three or something hours, then there's no more content left in Miss Survival, and it's pointless to make videos. So that's why we're not going to be doing Miss Survival live streams. Oh my god, it's like, that makes perfect sense. Yes, indeed, it makes perfect sense. But let's talk to Jane. Let's see what she's going to tell us. Jane, zombies attacked my caravan. Uh, they're on the highway. Help. I get it, but I can't leave the workshop unattended. Nobody's coming here anyways. But they'll die out there. Ah, here's someone who'll help you. Me. Please help me and my people, says Caravanner. Let's talk to the Caravanner. Uh, we found a van... And we were dragging it along the highway and we got attacked by blah 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 zombies. You're looking for parts? There are plenty of them in there. I love how... Head to the highway. Alright, let's go to the highway. I just love how... Whatever my character does, he does it for something. Like, people are dying and he's like... I need parts, you know? Like, I'm doing it for parts. I'm not doing it to save people, I'm literally doing it to... For parts. To get parts for my own minivan, which kind of doesn't make much sense. And hey, Robert Allen, thanks for being a member, and man, you make the best streams like the coolest guy in school. Everybody looks forward to seeing or speaking to that dude. Uh, thanks, mate, for the super chat. Hey, for the for being a member. And let's talk to this guy. Zombies, they surrounded us and the guy just died. Did he just wait for me to come here to die? Oh my god, save my people, they're over there. Is he dead? He's still alive. Whatever, let's save his people then. I don't even see who I'm fighting here. Oh, I thought it was done for. Uh, you're saying there are survivors? I'll stay with him. Go and repair him. I'm coming. Where did you put that medicine? Okay, apparently they're gonna do whatever. Find the source of the noise. I don't know what kind of noise do we have here. Doesn't really look like there's any noise. Give him a medkit before he dies. I cannot give him a medkit, guys. It doesn't work like that. They don't want my medkits. Alright, that dude is dead. Can I loot him? Apparently not. Let's deal with the bloodthirsty pass. So apparently it is the same highway as we had in Act 1. Except they moved it to Act 2. Alright, there's the guy. Darn bastards. And he has a grenade launcher, but he couldn't do anything. A uh, few, they were about to eat me. Thanks for help, I owe you one. Dude, you had a grenade launcher. That's it? Find one more survivor. Well, let's search for another survivor then. 
to say, the highway doesn't really seem that hard. Um, doing all right, I distracted that sick cruncher from you guys. And look here, what is he doing? He spat on those bastards. And let's deal with the sick cruncher then. Kill the sick cruncher. There are two more of the people out there. So we have to find the caravan. The guy just left. And Nancy Girl, thanks for becoming a member. Thanks for smashing the join button. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Rival Allen, thanks for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Thank you guys for being here. And apparently we still need to find the caravan. So we saved some of those people, but we still need to find the caravan. So let's search for it. Can we go through here? Nope. But I kind of like the highway location. I think it looks awesome. It looks great. That's it. That's the minivan. Oh wow, there's the big guy, the smasher. Guy died. Both of them died! I don't think I could have saved them. We'll be dealt with a smasher. Find a spark plug. So maybe we can find a spark plug here. Did we get it? Yes indeed, ladies and gents. We've gotten two spark plugs. Our first two spark plugs. If that's not epic, I don't know what is epic. So I think now we're gonna loot this entire uh, highway. And then we'll see if there's anything interesting here. Because there must be some more things. Also, there was a minivan, but we didn't get that thing from a minivan. We've gotten the spark plug from the vehicle. From the other car, not from the minivan. And Gaga Kremang, thanks for... Uh, thanks for being a member. You can wall trick the smasher with the truck's door. Says Gaga Kremang. Thanks for the super chat and thanks for the info. So you mean with this door? With this door here. Maybe that's th that's kind of cool. I'll definitely try it next time. Thanks for the info, Gaga Kremang. Thank you, thank you. Bloodthirsty fest. Alright, it doesn't really look like there are any other chests, but I just want to look, look this entire place. I want to see what other chests we can find here because there there must be something else. I'm pretty certain we haven't looted everything yet. There we go. There's a chest on this side. A backpack. A suitcase, actually. So let's loot the suitcase. Let's get some extra bandages. I mean, the five bandages from the highway. Not bad. Plus some leather. Not horrible. We still haven't looted this vehicle. Let's see what we can get here. There was a chest at the top right. Uh, we're gonna check the top right as well. Okay, so we looted the left door. Now let's loot the right door. Some iron, another bandage. At the top right. Well, I don't see anything at the top right. So I think, guys, we've looted kind of everything in this place. I don't think we've missed anything. Like, you can get here a few bandages and that's pretty much it. That's all the loot that you get at the highway. You left one bandage somewhere. It's fine, then. It is what it is. There's that engine that we've gotten. Nothing here. We've looted the top already. So let's go lower and let's see. Oh no, there's the tree. It's so weird, this this place is like a maze. I'm already stuck. And I'm stinking for some reason. Literally just by being in this highway, I started stinking. Oh, there's one more chest that we haven't looted. One more car. Let's check it out. Take the engine to Jane. Oof. It'll take forever to probably just to get to that chopper. But hey, it is doable probably. But hey, let's leave this place. Or you know what? Let's try to bring that engine. Why not? I won't make it here with the bike. So we'll have to bring it on foot. I'm doing it, guys. We are bringing that thing. 
We are bringing it. Except how do we get there? Okay, it's not that far. It looked like it was further away. It's not really that far. We'll get there. We can't take the bike inside. Yeah, apparently we cannot take it, so we'll have to walk there on foot. Take the engine, yes, and get deep, guys. Okay, we're gonna take that engine. It takes a while to bring this engine to the to the chopper. Would be cool if we could just drive the chopper there. But hey, we brought it. We brought it. Now we'll be able to give her that engine. We could also maybe recycle it at the base with the recycler. But it's not really worth it as we'll get just what, like scrap metal and maybe uh, some engine parts. Maybe. So it's kind of pointless to recycle it at the base, but it's kind of nice to give it to her. She can give a few points. And there we go. We are back at the highway. A at the gas station. We are back from the highway. And now we have to return back to the settlement. Okay, wait, before we return back to the settlement, I want to check my chopper. What do engines do? You can get points from Jennifer for giving her these engines. So let's go all the way here. Let's get it. So I think we could drop this thing. There we go. We've gotten a few points for the chopper. We still don't have enough points to get to level 69. And then we still need a few more levels to finish our chopper to the max level. As there are still a few more things that we need to upgrade. Maybe the durability or something. I don't know what we are still upgrading in the chopper, but... There are still a few more levels to upgrade the chopper. Points for Jennifer of oh, you are in maxed out on your bike. Yeah, we still need more points, so... I mean, maybe highway is going to be kind of alright, because we'll be able to always steal at least one engine from the highway. And how often does it reset? Does it say? Alright, it resets every two days. Okay, so every two days we can go to the highway, we can get some of those spark plugs. We can maybe get a few bandages here and there. And yeah... Okay, so the tactical backpack is probably from spinning caps. It doesn't even mention that you can get bandages there. Which is kind of weird, or I just don't see them. But yeah, it doesn't really say that you can get bandages there. But in my opinion, bandages were the best loot in the gas station. Well, besides those uh, spark plugs. Let's talk to Connor. Got spark plugs good. Now install them in the minivan. Alright, let's drop it here. Finished minivan repairs. Okay, so we just have to finish the minivan then. Understandable. Have a nice day. So every two days we can get some more spark plugs. It won't start without a spark plug. Maybe there are some at the gas station. Alright, so we're gonna go to the gas station again after it resets. And let's open this thing up. And what do we have here? All right, so we still need to to get the minivans. And we have a few more tasks. We have two more tasks. So we have to finish the minivan, and then we'll probably have to talk to Connor. And then that's it. The tasks are finished. And I still think we'll need to wait a while until we get the continuation of this act two. Because this act two is not full yet. We only have... Do we have missions here or something? Yes, we have only... No, not missions, but chapters, right? We only have here chapter 1, we still don't have chapter 2, so we don't know when it's gonna come out. But I probably when chapter 2 comes out, I think that's when we're gonna get some more permanent content. I guess. So that is pretty epic. I'm happy, guys. We have we have unlocked the highway. We have a new location to to, to grind. 
Kind of an interesting location. It's nothing too hard there. We don't really get insane loot there either. So probably as soon as we get the spark plugs, we'll stop going to the highway. The same thing as with the abandoned factory after you uh, get enough of those uh, radio antennas. You don't need to go th to the abandoned factory ever again. Same thing with the motel basement. And same thing with the... With, with the farm location now, after those iron wires. Well, we are still gonna go to the farm location, but yeah. We no longer need those iron wires, and we will probably no longer need the spark plugs, so the highway will become useless after we assemble the minivan. Which is kind of sad. I wish that the highway was maybe a bit better. It had a bit better loot, so that there was a point to come back to it. But I will see. We'll loot it a few more times. Maybe we'll find that hey, you can get there a decent amount of bandages or something. Uh, Nancy Girl, thanks for the super chat. Uh, do you think we'll be able to drive the minivan? I doubt it. I really doubt it because we can drive the chopper and it doesn't really do much. So I don't know why would they allow us to drive the minivan. I don't think. I mean, we still cannot drive the ATV. So I doubt that we'll be able to drive the minivan. But hey, hopefully I'm wrong. Hopefully they'll allow us to drive it. That would be really fun. I was searching for my pump. There we go, we have it here. Let's get the water. Alright, let's drink some water. Let's go to the outhouse. How is it good to find engine for Vader tasks, says Azim. That's actually a big brain... Big brain observation, because that's true, you can get those... Uh, engines for the Raiders, and you need two of those engines, so hey, at least you can get a guaranteed engine from the highway, because I think you get a guaranteed engine there. So the highway maybe isn't that bad, highway is better than the abandoned factory. Could be like they did to the boat. First time you jumped on it, there was an animation, and then they removed it, so Shadow Duffer. Yes, I think probably that's what's gonna happen with the minivan, maybe. Like, we assemble the minivan, we sit on it, and then we'll drive off somewhere with that minivan. And then that's it. But I wouldn't be even surprised if we don't even get to use that minivan. I feel like... Like, he said that, hey, we, my people will need the minivan, right? Like, his friends will need it. So maybe we won't even be the ones using it. Maybe it'll be like something... Uh, you know, as in Sector 7, there's the guy with the chopper. You touch the chopper, and then you get like a bunch of events. So maybe that's how the minivan is gonna work. Like, I'm gonna assume that maybe you're gonna touch that minivan, and then you'll get like some sort of events where you could go to with those, uh, friends. At the settlement, maybe. Or maybe I'm just wrong. I don't know. But that would be my guess how minivan is gonna work. I think mini minivan is gonna give us some sort of events. Maybe. Maybe. Alright, let's drop this electronic circuit there. Alright, we have to stay 20 waves in the police department. So I think we could do that real quick, then we can kill the witch. We can deal with a dead face. Where's the dead face? In the limestone ridge? Well, there we go. Assume we dealt with it already. So let's quickly do 20 waves at the police department. Let's speed run that stuff. We're gonna get stack of grenades. And then let's go for the first raid of the day. When is more missed survival coming? Tomorrow. There is more missed survival tomorrow. Let's get a few of those weapons. And probably more Glocks. We don't need more weapons than that. There we go. That's more than enough for 20 waves. More than enough. But I'm also curious what kind of a permanent content we're gonna get there. Also, to those that have just joined, welcome to the stream. So we've just assembled the... We've just gotten a few spark plugs 
for the minivan. We still haven't assembled the minivan. We need more. But uh, for those who haven't seen it yet, developers have shared these sorts of sneak peeks. So apparently new workbenches are going to be coming to that settlement. I don't know what we can do with those workbenches. But hey, that'll be something. So if you have any idea what those workbenches could be, then let me know. Let us know. But yeah, it looks like the settlement is going to be bigger than it is right now. There will be more things to it. If I had to bet, guys, when helicopter comes out, if it ever comes out, right? Because in the 3, 4, and in Act 5, right? Maybe we'll get that helicopter and maybe we'll be able to build that helicopter only in the settlement. Like, I think if... If we can build it, it's going to be in the settlement. Like, there's no way... That they'll let us build the helicopter at this base when... There's the settlement. There we go, we have these broken items, that's fine, we'll bring it, and we are going to do... 20 waves, I just need another armor. There we go, let's take that. Sark usually streams every two days, like Bunker Alpha reset time. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. because live streaming lasts on Earth every single day. There isn't much things to do, as we're gonna mostly clear, like, Bunker Alpha or whatever in one day, and then we need to wait until it resets anyways. So, doing a live stream every two days is kind of alright, as then most of the locations that we cleared are reset. And we can do more things. Uh, we are going to the police department. Let's go. Let's go here. Reset sewer and highway. Sometime collect these items as they take a long time. I mean, they're already reset. I can't go there as they've reset already. So in two days, we'll try to get some more asbestos. We'll try to get some more uh, spark plugs. But even after we get all of those things, like, nothing yet is gonna happen, is we don't have chapter 2. So we don't know anything about it. But developers said that this fall we're gonna get some sort of a big update, lots of permanent content, and it'll be huge. So I'm excited. So most of the vehicles are not accessible yet, says Jace. Uh, you can craft a chopper, you can craft a boat, you can craft your ATV, you cannot craft a helicopter, and you cannot craft the... I mean, you can assemble the minivan, but so far it's not gonna do much, probably. I don't know, I haven't assembled it. So the only vehicle that's not in the game is the helicopters. You cannot craft the helicopter, but every other vehicle is in the game. But yeah, I get it why you probably said this, because I said when... A uh, helicopter comes out here and showing this thing. So yeah, guys, we already have all of these vehicles. We just don't have the helicopter. We have all of these vehicles that you see here in the stories. We just don't have the helicopter yet. Alright, let's deal with some of these guys. We are also going to clear this room here. This way it'll be easier to throw those grenades because sometimes when we don't clear this room, my character will aggro on these jailbirds or whatnot. And he'll start throwing the grenade uh, their way. Right now I'm still gathering antennas and screws even though headquarters is finished. I think we will need them in the future. Update says Shadow Duffer. Shadow Duffer. You are somewhat of a big brain. I do believe that maybe we will require more of those antennas, more of those screws, maybe more of those iron wires later on. I do agree with that. That's actually pretty smart. Maybe we should... Maybe I should start gathering that stuff as well. That's actually pretty smart. I'll try to gather them. I'm not gonna gather, like, hundreds of them, but I'll try to maybe gather, like, extra 10 screws, maybe more. Depends. We'll see. But that's actually pretty smart. Thanks for the... Thanks for this... A uh, pretty big brain idea. 5,000 screws for the helicopter. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna be the amount of screws that we need to get. But who knows. Yeah. 
wouldn't be surprised, to be honest. I mean, it'll take forever. How many screws do we get per run? Like, let's say four screws. That's gonna take, like, you forever and a little bit to get the 5,000 screws. Wait. Just to, to humor ourselves, let's see how many screws that would take. Let's say we get four screws each run. So we need to do 1,250 runs. And we can do a run every day and a half in the motel. So that's 1,875 days. That's about five years. So it'll take you five years, guys, if you're gonna play the game nonstop to get 5,000 screws for the helicopter. And to those that have just joined, they're gonna be like, oh my god, Saik, five years to assemble the helicopter. We're just making up numbers. We're just talking random numbers, guys. Helicopter is not confirmed. Nothing's confirmed. We're just making fun of things. And that's it. And still, it would be probably easier to get the helicopter than... than ATV. Well, probably in five years, you can assemble your ATV as well. What is the new Miss Survival video? Tomorrow, there is a new Miss Survival video tomorrow. Alright, let's drop that thing here. Otherwise, it doesn't make sense adding all of it just for the settlement and keeping all of these items available for gathering, says Shadow Duffer. I agree with you, but at the same time, we are talking about last day on Earth. That's what they do. I mean, most of the things are useless. Like, same thing with Bunker Alpha, right? You assemble your chopper, you still keep getting those things, but they're useless. You still keep getting the chopper forks, you still keep getting the chopper gas things. You can't give them to Jennifer, but they're kind of useless. Same thing with ATV. Like, after you assemble your ATV, Bunker Bravo becomes absolutely useless. Like, they've added an entire Bunker Bravo, but it becomes useless after you get the ATV. And the boat? The boat is kind of useless as well. Like, what can you do with the boat? You can get sand, you can get glass, but after you kind of... ...assemble some things, it becomes useless as well. So there are lots of things, lots of useless locations in the game that after you assemble some some things, they become useless. So I wouldn't be surprised that we will no longer need the screws, the antennas, and everything else. But hey, hopefully we'll need them. So yeah, but I will probably be doing maybe Abandoned Factory once in a while to get an antenna. Maybe we will go to the sewers. Uh, not to the sewers, but to the... To the basement in the motel just to get some extra screws. We will be clearing the farm location anyway, so I might as well just keep gathering those iron wires. So yeah, I'll probably be getting those items, but... Yeah, I don't think we'll ever use them, but I don't see a reason why not get them. Oops. Made a few shots. What time BST do you typically go live? BST, you mean British summertime. I'm curious. BST to... I mean BST time now. Oh, it's okay. It's our... Behind... Um, around 4, around 4 p.m., give or take an hour or two hours. All right, so far we are level 11 and still zero green cards, zero... Okay, there we go, there's a green card, still zero blue though. And yeah, currently we are clearing 20 waves because we are getting ready to do 99... Uh, because we are getting ready for the first raid of the day and almost died there from that explosive zombie. Almost went into that radius and died. Probably I had iron wire saved from something else and they deleted those. I was like, 
what? Well, actually, that doesn't work. We tried it before they deleted those wires, right? We had metal wires. We need iron wires, but we had metal wires before. And the people, and myself included, we tried dragging those items into the wall, but it didn't work. Those wires did not work. There were different ones. They looked the same, and they were named almost the same, but they were not the same wires. Because I think during season 24, I don't know, just a random number. During whatever season, we could get the, some sort of pins. So we would get, like, iron wires, and from those iron wires, we could get pins. Wires for the biker pin events. Yes, that's tough. But we couldn't use those wires anyways. We tried using them, but they didn't work. Developers are very cheeky about it. Let's get this. Um, well, I didn't take more first aid kits, but hopefully that's going to be enough. I don't know why I didn't take more. Let's go wave 15. We need five more waves, so probably those first aid kits are going to be enough. There we go. That was a decent grenade. Except we missed this explosive zombie for some reason. The grenade was kind of too far away from us. They're going to let's deal with the right zombie. Let's pick up these cards. And again, I usually say that every time we do the police department. So try to pick up cards as they will despawn if you don't pick them up. As there's only a limited amount of dead bodies that can be on the map. And I've even experienced that myself. Once we were clearing 99 waves and I didn't pick up cards maybe for like 5, 6, 7 waves. And then as soon as I started a new wave, I saw a few dead bodies just disappear from the minimap. So it does happen. It's not a rumor. It's not a an urban legend. It does happen. So pick up your cards or they will despawn. All right, let's drop that here. Okay, so we only have a ride zombie left. Let's wait until it drops the shield. I did try to use those and they didn't work and I thought maybe we... Maybe when they open the farm event, they'll work, and then they were gone. Yeah, they removed those metal wires. I assume they removed them to to remove the confusion, because I think a lot of people tried to maybe use those metal wires, and they looked exactly the same as the, the iron wires needed for the wall. So there's that. And Robert Allen, thanks for the fist bump super sticker. Thank you, mate, for being here. Welcome to the stream once again. There we go. That was a very nice grenade. It's like I try to toss the grenade like you do, but it never goes like I want. It's annoying, like, trying to, to do the wall trick. Hate getting punched in the face. Um. Well, with the grenade, like, you just go there and you tap on the grenade. You stay on the grenade, you wait until they come here, and then you leave, and that's it. Sometimes you'll get damaged, sometimes you won't. But you just stab that grenade. I don't really know if I ever mentioned this. I probably mentioned that in the past. But you don't need to throw that grenade, you just need to tap it. You don't need to aim or anything, just tap it quickly. Because if you're gonna lo hold it longer, then you'll start aiming and it's not gonna work. It's like, why you stop using MGL? I mean, I didn't stop using it. We we're just doing 99. We're just doing 20 waves here, so we don't really need an MGL for it. Let's go, guys, for the 20th wave. Oh, no, I don't have the grenades anymore. I didn't take a... Um, no. Well, there weren't a lot of zombies. We could have exploded all of them with, the, with one grenade. That would have been perfect. Are you opening a purple card today? Manifesting that machine blueprint for you. We're not opening the purple card today as we're doing only 20 waves for the raid. We are not doing 99 waves because I didn't really get ready for it. I didn't get enough. 
uh, healing items, not enough grenades, not enough weapons. I still have four grenades, so I might as well just use them and then we can skedaddle from this place and go for the raid number one of the day. No, oh my goodness, I clicked wrong buttons. Well, it still worked. So can you show your mods on M16? Well, these are the mods on the M16. If you want to learn more about the mods, just type Cyric, uh, LDOE Cyric mods. And there I explain everything about last day on earth mods. I show best mods that you can have. Which mods you should craft, which mods you shouldn't craft. Best non-purple mods. Good luck, Robert Allen. Thanks for being here. Good luck. And we need to... Do two more waves and that's it. Then we can leave it. We still have two more grenades. Alright, they exploded. And let's say, guys, one more wave. Maybe we'll get another blue card. That would be very lovely. I'll... Maybe I'll open up those blue cards here today. Or maybe we'll save them for later. Right, let's probably surrender. There's nothing else we can do here. We have this broken armor that I'll probably keep here because I'm too lazy to delete it. Don't want to really bring it back to the base. And that is it. So yeah, maybe let's bring these cards to the base. Why not? We'll save them for more purple cards. Open some green. We could open up green. Maybe. But at the same time, I, I don't really want to... Uh, use the space in these conveyors as we might be opening up purple cards maybe next live stream or something. But we'll see. I don't know. Whatever. Let's just get back to the base. Why don't you use the keys? Well, alright guys. Let's go. Let's open up those keys then. Let's get our nothing. Actually forgot that we even have the keys, so might as well just use them. Let's get the carrot and let's get whatever else we get here. Speaking of carrots, we have actually gotten some carrots here. And some canned food uh, under that bed. Very, very epic. Alright, so let's get back to the base and let's get ready for the first raid of the day. Let's see what that raid's gonna be about. Three by three stone room, the first raid. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if we're just gonna get like that three by three stone room. That is the most common base that we get to raid. <sighs> well, whatever. Let's drop these cards here. We have bunch of brown. We need to bring them. We'll get like twenty green for that. That'll be lovely. And we need to kill the witch. So let's get another armor set. And let's deal with the witch. Do you have a spark plug? Yes, we've just gotten a spark plug for the minivan. We've gotten two spark plugs, not even one. From the highway. Alright, let's get enough of those uh, first aid kits. 
We have a sprite shot and these weapons are done. That's it. Let's just eat some carrots. And let's go. Once again, the reason why we eat those carrots is just so that I don't pee. Because if we're going to drink water, I'll pee. Then it will stink. Then we'll need to take a shower. So that's why we just eat a bunch of those carrots. Means four rounds to finish the minivan. Well, if we always get those two spark plugs, I'm pretty certain sometimes you'll get one. Sometimes you'll just get zero. Because maybe it's not guaranteed. So there is that. Uh, where are we going? I've forgotten. Okay, we are going to the infected forest. It's like, did you check the calendar event? Arena is twice this month. I think on September 9th or something, we'll get the arena event. There we go. On September 7th, we will get this arena event. We'll be able to get two more purple blueprints, which I think is the best event to get purple blueprints. So there's that. So I guess that's pretty cool that the arena event is here. As I said many times, that arena event is probably one of the, the best events. Especially if you want purple blueprints. If you don't want purple blueprints, then hey, maybe it's not that useful. But if you need them, then it's the cheapest way to get them. You know what's good with carrots? Hummus. I don't know, never tried hummus, and I still think hummus is a paid actor. It's not a real sauce. Yesterday I made rice with chicken and curry, but I tried some new curry and it was very spicy, even though on the bottom it says that it's not spicy. It was super spicy. It was like the spiciest food I've eaten in forever. But I still ate it like a champ, ladies and gents. Alright, let's slow her down with that shot. We still haven't even assembled the blueprint. We have gotten the Glock power shot, and I yet um I still haven't assembled it. I noticed a lot of games nerfed their rewards. Inflation in the uh, games. Inflation is here in games as well, yes indeed. I mean I haven't really noticed that. As I don't really play lots of other games with the rewards. Alright, let's damage the witch. There we go. She's gonna start yelling. Spread shot. Nice spread shot. That's almost 10 out of 10 spread shot. We can give it 9 out of 10 because, like, that guy survived. And he has 100 health, so we kind of have to get lucky, but whatever. 9 out of 10 spread shot. Really nice spread shot. Stop it, you're making me hungry talking about curry. The the point is, I've seen a video recently on how what else they use with curry. I try to use the tomato sauce, some cream, and then you can use chicken stock. Or chicken broth, or whatever they call it. And then you add curry to that. I mean, it tasted fine. As I said, it was just a bit too spicy. So I stopped talking about curry. So I keeps uh, talking about it. <laughs> All right, let's deal with the witch. We got nothing. No big bones. Nothing. Potatoes with curry. If you eat potatoes, I never tried eating potatoes with curry. I'll definitely need to try it one day. I usually eat rice and chicken with curry. I never tried eating it with potatoes, but I assume they taste nice. Deal breaker. Do you like ketchup? I think it's awful. I mean, it might be awful. I'm not saying that it's great. I usually tried eating uh, curry with, with cream. 
or like whatever you call it. Like I, I, I don't really know if it's cream or not. It's like thick, thick milk. Let's say it like that. We just add curry spices to that and it tastes kind of nice. I just saw some people adding tomato sauce to that and it tastes kind of all right. Uh, okay, so we need to craft five hatchets. We need to craft a set of armor and then we can go for the first raid of the day. It's like Tricob had a game, so I've seen this comment like probably 20 times during this livestream. I don't think I'll be playing the Cubhead game, but thank you for the suggestion. I've heard of it. I've seen a few videos on it. I think it's a cool game, but I don't think I'll be playing it here. So hopefully that answers your question. <laughs> The armor. Let's go. Let's grab that armor. Let's get these, these, some rope. Do you remember Metro Exodus? Yes, indeed, I do remember Metro Exodus. Of course, I remember that. I wish we had another game. Like, I'm searching for another, some sort of awesome single player story game. Like Metro Exodus, like The Last of Us, or something else, as it's been a while since we've played a single player story game, and they're always awesome. Something like Days Gone. Like, all the single-player story games that we played here on the channel, they were all awesome. Something like Dying Light. And I just can't find anything cool. Well, I do know I'm waiting for probably... Um... Whatever that thing's called, I forgot. God of War Ragnarok. We, we might play that, but it comes out on uh, in November 9th. And we need hatchets. There we go. Almost forgotten about that. Let's get some duct tape. And let's craft five iron hatchets. Alright, let's craft five iron hatchets. I'm really glad you finished Metro Exodus, by the way, even though not a lot of people were watching it. Uh, thanks for watching the Metro Exodus Saddle Duffer. Yeah, I really liked the game. I, I wanted to finish it. It was really cool. Where is the spotlight coming from when you're a character? I don't know where it's coming from, but I kind of like what the game is doing here. Like, I think it the, the, the game looks... Um... Better. I mean, it looks maybe kind of weird on these chests, but the character looks kind of cool. There are some other games, and the character won't look as good as the character in Last Day on Earth Survival. Like, it's kind of illuminating a little bit of light. So it looks better. It's maybe not realistic, but I think it looks better when it illuminates a little bit of light. Does it make sense? I don't know. All I know is that I think it looks better. It's from the beard. Yes, the beard is shining. Let's drop the duct tape. Let's get five simple hatchets. Wait, maybe there are some other things. No, I don't think there are other things to do. Because of the bag. I don't think the bag illuminates the light. Like, it doesn't matter which bag we use, we can... ...have no skin and we are still go going to shine here. Like, no matter what, we are still shining. Visually dynamic, says Lila Bowers. Well, I'm not 100% sure what it means, but... ...let's say that, yes, it is visually dynamic. Let's get some wood. 
some stones. What can you do with extra th things in the settlement? Not thing yet. All right, so let's get these things. Let's craft uh, five hatchets. Four or five. He's wearing Lenovo smart goggles. Does such a thing even exist? I'm going to Google it right now. Lenovo smart goggles. <laughs> is that even a thing or did you just make some things up? Actually, there is something like this. Lenovo Think Reality A3 smart glasses. I don't know what they do. But I don't think they'll make me smart. I mean, look at this dude, guys. Check this out. Uh, the smart glasses, guys. Do you think these glasses would make me smart? These glasses here, do you think they'd make me smart? I don't think so. But hey. Let's go for the raid number one now. Finally, we are ready for it. Smart goggles, hey? Yeah, we have enough of everything. These glasses will make you look like Clark Kent. I have no idea who that is, but I'm gonna say that he has that stroke. Isn't that Spider-Man? But Cyric, it's not Spider-Man. Guys, Clark Kent is Spider-Man. Uh, Madvedo, let's raid this base. Madvedo. LDOE, raid Madvedo. Nancy Girl says Spider-Man. Yes, I said that it's a Spider-Man. Um, let's see what this base is all about. All right. Let's go for the raid. Yes, Clark Kent is Spider-Man. It is Spider-Man. Everybody knows that it's a Spider-Man. There is a temporary perk from the oven to make less noise. Yes, if we're going to cook that fish buff, but we don't have it. And this base probably isn't going to be that huge. So the fish buff won't make much sense for us anyways. I think with the fish buff, you can open up one extra chest. I should probably make one less noise or something. And you make maybe 10% less noise. Something like that. Whatever, let's get one C4. And let's drop a here-ish. Clark is Batman, says Rico. Okay. It was Spider-Man, now it's Batman. And dude, we have two more C4s with us. Why do we need it? Batman. My favorite hero from SpongeBob. Batman. Alright, so we have only four chests. So from the research that I've done, guys, all these other rooms are going to have absolutely nothing. They'll be empty. So only this room is going to have chests. So, hey, let's loot these chests. We're going to get seven gasoline canisters, which... Something. Could have been worse. Let's get some of the pieces of cloth, some thick cloth, and katana. Mm. Alright. 
Still, so far this base probably does not get Sykes approval. But I think it could have been worse. There we go, we've gotten a Glock. Stack of iron. There we go, and stack of Zulu cards. Psych Zulu cards! They're useless, like they're absolutely useless. They're worse than grass. Like grass at least is useful. These Zulu cards are useless. But I'm still bringing them back to the base. So this base does not get Sykes approval. Seems like a pretty bad base. I'd give it one and a half out of 10. It doesn't get two out of 10. And usually two out of 10 gets Sykes approval. All right, so let's go to the settlement. And then from the settlement, we can go back to the base for free. Why can't connect to the game? It says warning. Unable to connect to the server. Um, I don't know why it says that. That extra chest during raids makes all the difference. More MGLs, yes indeed, more MGLs, more... More scars to get. Definitely. Watch the chopper. Guys, we're not washing the chopper, it is clean already. Give me guys at least three reasons. Right? Give me an 800 word essay. Is it a really an 800 word essay? Uh... I'll just Google average word count essay. And what will Google spit me out? Av average word count essay. 300 to 1000 words. Okay guys, 1000 word essay right now. Why I should wash my chopper. And then I'll consider washing it. Do we have a deal? Because it's so dirty, Sayak, but that's like one, two, three, four, five words. You need 995 more words to convince me. Mm, let's drop Zulu cards. I've never tried paying raiders with Zulu cards. Will they accept them or not? Stack of Zulu cards. Seems true in you. I could trust you. Three Zulu cards, they take them. Oh my god, like, don't give them. That's it, we gave them Zulu cards. Too late. I paid them with useless Zulu cards. This is fun. What are Zulu cards supposed to be for anyways? For a Zulu bunker, apparently. But we don't have that Zulu bunker. How do you level up fast? By doing bunker alpha. That's the fastest way to level up. And also, uh, getting the buff from the healer to get 100% more experience. Alright, so somehow, someway, guys, so we've sorted out the inventory. And let's talk to the raiders. Let's see what other tasks we have to do. Uh, find Colonel at the factory. Okay. Okay, okay, understandable. Have a nice day. So we're gonna go to the factory. Maybe we'll even get that extra antenna from the factory while we're at it. And plus we need to clear the fourth floor. Let's go. This, this, this. And, uh... I don't think there's anything else we need with us. I mean, some of these broken glocks, let's just use them because they just take space in the inventory. Seems pointless to have those items. It's like, when will you upload another Miss Survival video? Tomorrow there's a new Miss Survival video. Uh, wrong button. Alright, that's it. We are done with everything. 
I hope Kefir increases the cap level from 209 to 300 at least. I have stocks and I have stacks and stacks of XP books. So Shadow Duffer. You know what? I think it would be kind of cool if we could level up. Maybe indefinitely and each level gives you plus one health. Like it doesn't really seem that OP, but plus 100 extra levels would give you 100 more health. Oh my god, Tech, you're a genius! Thank you. Thank you very much. I am somewhat of a genius. You should watch your 52 level chopper. I twitch and have a TV transistor, but there is no bot and we can't call Raider on the radio. Okay, that's a good enough reason for me to watch the chopper. Some people watching the live stream right now. What did you just say? I don't know, guys. I've just read a comment that told me to watch the chopper and I will watch it. Because it seemed reasonable enough. There we go, guys. We watched the chopper. Are you happy? Guys, are you happy that I've watched the chopper? It'll be dirty again in a few days. Maybe even today. It's the same, guys! It didn't even change the color! It looks the same! Almost the same. Maybe it looks kind of better. Clean chopper is a goop. Says Infinity Swift. 100% agree with you. That dirt was awesome. Um, I'm lost right now. Where where am I? Who am I? What am I doing here? Wait, I just left with weapons to go to um, oh the the abandoned factory. Kill Colonel there. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. I know where I'm going. I know who I am. Welcome. It would have taken me 84 years to write that essay. I don't think so. Just a few sleepless nights. Alright, let's deal with the fast biter. Let's get the... The, the guy here, and maybe we're gonna get another antenna while we're here. What if we'll ever need those antennas, which I kind of doubt that, but... You know what? Every time we get this task, I'll come here and I'll get those antennas. I won't be particularly clearing the abandoned factory all the time. But I'll come here once in a while. Whenever Raiders ask me to, to come here and then I'll get that extra antenna. So one day, you know, if we ever need like 10 extra antennas, I won't need to spend 100 years to get them. No more swamp runs, Cyric. We used to do them at the beginning of the streams. I used to go to the swamp location, but... Yeah. That's all I can say about it. Maybe one day we'll go back to the swamp location, maybe. Thousand words isn't much, maybe one, two hours as Lords of Darkness. Well, well, well. I'm waiting for your essay then. But Cyric! Hey, Cyric, been watching you Hello. for a year now. First time watching you live. You are amazing. First time watching you live. It's kind of weird how the bot read it live, not live. First time watching you live. I'm for the first time alive. Thank you, Kevin, for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. I'm glad that you're enjoying the live stream. I'm glad that you caught us live here. Welcome, welcome, Kevin. Hello, hello. Thanks for being here. And I'm alive, ladies and gents. Okay, the floater bloater.
Alright, so we're gonna get this and then we'll go to the basement. Most people don't enjoy gathering RSS in the swamp again. What is RSS? Probably mean resources. There we go, guys. You see? I just... I'm a genius. Resources in the swamp. I remember the stream where people wanted Tyke to leave the swamp and go for a raid. He has not been the same ever since, says Shadow Duffer. It's all the time the same. Every time I go to the swamp location, people will always say that I should leave it and do something else. But it's like last day on Earth, right? That's what last day on Earth is all about. It's about grinding. But I don't really go to the swamp because of, like, mainly that reason. Because it's boring for a lot of people. And I wouldn't really say that it's very exciting for me to go and farm that wood, but... Eh. There's that. Ahmed Mahim, thanks for the super chat. Uh, show me your VIP level. I'm on level... 6. Um... I can check it out. We are here-ish. There. This is the, the 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 VAP level. See, hopefully that answers the question. And we can go here and we can get that antenna. So I had to do many swamp runs to get Pete and Ash. He had to kick Ash. What? I mean, if there was a reason to go to the swamp location to get ash logs to upgrade something, I wouldn't hesitate going there. It's just that, like, getting ash logs for something that we already have, it's... And plus, it's kind of boring to get it. I don't know. Like, it's the same thing as going to the motel. Like, when we had to go to the motel to get those screws, like, it was fun to go there. But now to clear motel, it's like, why would I go there? Did you get the kernel? I don't know. We'll check it out. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Let's drop that thing here. It's like, what times are you live streaming? Usually around 4, 5, 6 p.m. Central European time. I usually st start around those times. Well, let's deal with these guys. We're losing some health. I probably should... Wait, do we lose health here? Okay, I don't think there's gas in this room. Epic. Let's switch the breaker. The electricity is off. We can... Do those things and... There we go. We are done. Kind of. So where's the chest? The chest has got to be here. And Arkecho Duri. Sorry for butchering the name. Thanks for the super chat watching for two years. Love your content. Thanks, mate, for watching the live streams for such a long time. And the videos. Welcome to the stream, mate. Glad that you're enjoying it. And there we go. We've got another antenna. Let's get back here. Uh, super chat. Bonjour, Le Cyric. Nice t-shirt, says DA. Welcome, DA, to the stream. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> it's a very nice t-shirt. I've only had it. This t-shirt is probably one of my oldest t-shirts that I have. I still don't know how it's... How it did it disintegrate? Is there a word like this? There's gotta be a word like this. Disintegrate. 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 There is a word like this. I told you guys. Disintegrate. I'm still surprised how the shirt didn't disintegrate into... Into nothing. But it's probably like seven, eight years old. So that's it. We've gotten that thing. Let's search for the colonel because I'm not certain that we found him here yet.
Colonel. No, just a toxic spitter. Colonel's gotta be here then. There we go, there's the Colonel. So let's get the Colonel for the Raiders. There we go, got him. The shirt is Tiger's best investment. I mean, it wasn't my investment. It was probably my parents' investment. But yeah, I hope this shirt is still gonna serve me next like 20 years at least. I'm gonna pass down this shirt to my children and my children will pass it down to their children. So my grand, 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 grandchildren will be wearing this shirt. That's at least my dream. It's like any new merch for the fall and winter. I have no idea. Like, that's literally the only answer that I could give. I have no idea. Let's drop this here. Wait, this shirt is more than seven years old. It might be 10 years old, easy, 10 plus years old. Like there's no date on the t-shirt, but it's, it's 10 years old, easy. Pretty cool. Maybe when your grand, 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 grandchildren take that shirt, the helicopter will be added, says Lords of Darkness. Maybe. Maybe you are right. Okay, guys, let's also go to the fourth floor. Let's quickly clear that fourth floor and then we can go to the second raid of the day. It's like grandkids be like, what? Granddad left us this old rag? What the heck? Dude, this is not going to be an old rag. This is a nice t-shirt. This is a very comfy t-shirt. Um, The C4s will go there. The antennas fit there. It's like in Miss Survival, you left shotgun silencer and tactical gloves. If I ever leave something, guys, leave a timestamp in the in the comments. I can always go back and take that stuff. Somebody said that I left a rifle in in, in Miss Survival, but I didn't leave a timestamp where, so how am I going to find it? So guys, if I leave something, leave a timestamp, and I'll definitely check it, and I'll be able to go back and get it. Mm, and the fourth floor. Let's also get the doggo, you guys are telling me. Okay, we're going to get the doggo as well. All right, so we're gonna clear the fourth floor with these broken weapons. With these completely broken weapons. It's a pro t-shirt, it will outli outlive Earth itself, yes indeed. <laughs> yes indeed. All right, let's get another stack of those. We're definitely, like, maybe taking way too many weapons, but... Hey, let's also feed the doggos. Yeah, we gotta feed the doggos. When is the next last day on Earth live stream? We're live streaming it today, right now. Oh my god, it's like I had no idea. Thank you. You're welcome. But the next last day on Earth live stream is probably gonna be after tomorrow. But we are also streaming it, like, today, like, right now. All right, all right, so let's roll to the fourth floor. Well, barely could leave that base. No way, I thought this was Sims 4. Yes, indeed. It does look like Sims 4, doesn't it? Hey, guys, I'll need the password. Thank you very much. It's like, please tell, do like this season outfit. I don't have any skins, as you can see. So, I don't care how the skin looks like, really. I haven't tried more than half of the skins here, probably. I 
All right, 53040. 5, 53040. 53040. 5, 5, Did it work? Yes, indeed, it worked. Thanks, guys, for the password. Really cool. Thank you, thank you. So now let's speed run through the fourth floor and then we can go for the second raid of the day. Let's go to the fourth floor. Bunker Beverly. Do you have any new Last Day on Earth tier videos planned? Um, I don't know if there will be any more videos, but I wanted to do some more tier lists during live streams. Like maybe boss tier list, armor tier list. I had some things written down, but probably I lost it. Okay, so we have zombie tier list, armor tier list, and boss tier list. Those are the three things that I have written down. Maybe we'll do them one day. Maybe on the video, maybe during a live stream. I don't know. We need to gather all the zombies. There are lots of zombies in the game. I need to gather all of them. The toxic spitters, the roaming zombies. And then there are some zombies that look the same, but they're named Hello differently. Hello from Norway. Nice to say you live again slightly smiling face now. I am Havwe on all the LDOE vid. You made slightly smiling face so much change. Uh, Lars Robin, thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Glad that you're enjoying the live streams. Welcome, welcome. Hey, uh, good luck with your last day on Earth journey. And uh, our armor is gonna break. That is sad. But yeah, Lara, thanks for everything. Welcome, welcome. To the stream. Perks tier list. I mean, the, the perks in the game, we don't really have lots of perks, do we? What kind of even perks are we talking about? Like, what kind of perks? I know this thing is gonna break. My armor is about to break, so I do feel like we will have to take a new armor from the inbox. All right, hopefully I don't freeze to death here. Okay, this armor should be enough for the frenzy giant. The stream has gone back to 4K quality. Now we don't have 4K quality. We have 1440p quality, but. Yeah, every time it goes down, you can just go to the settings and switch the quality manually. It should always be good. I guess. Alright, let's deal with the first turret, then we'll get more Glocks. More other turrets. So a few rooms left and uh, yeah, we have bunker. We have the second raid of the day. All right, nothing here. Let's deal with the French giant. Miss True Friend Room. Okay, we're gonna go back up and we will loot that True Friend Doggo room. 
Or maybe I've checked it. I think you're lying. Oh, no, we haven't checked it yet. Okay, cool. Go on, Doggo. Open the crate. Nothing. <laughs> I... I have no words. I didn't even think it's possible to get that thing in the... In this room. I always thought that you can get that gun oil only in the first special room. But the second true friend uh, dog room would didn't have those gun oils. It would only have guns or something else. All right, let's get a new armor. Equipment. Do I have boots? Apparently. Oh, no, I do have boots. Let's get the boots. Let's get this. We should play some Rust. We've, I've made some videos on Rust. Maybe there will be more Rust in the future. But again, that doesn't mean that I promise there will be more Rust. Because I'm like, that's like you promised more Rust. No, guys. I'm saying that maybe there will be more Rust in the future. But it doesn't mean that there will be. Maybe. Probably not. But we never know. Sometimes iron plate. You, you never get iron plates in that place. I don't think I've ever gotten one. How to get more storage on my bike? You need to go to the gas station and upgrade your bike there. You need to bring like whatever various resources and keep upgrading your bike and keep selecting the storage. Rust videos are promised. Curved in stone and sealed with blood. Yes, indeed. I even have a tattoo, guys, that says there will be more Rust videos on my forehead. Yeah, maybe there will be more Rust, like a casual Rust live stream, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Um... Yeah, I think there's nothing else we need to do here. Let's get back to the base and let's get ready for the for the other raid. For the second raid. Forehead tattoo is only visible with a UV lamp though. Okay. I mean, I do have a UV lamp. Except I don't know where it is, guys. But I do have a UV flashlight. I have a UV flashlight. What games do you play off camera? I usually play... Like, currently I only play Age of Empires 4. That's the only thing that I play. Alright, I'll drop the steel, the weapons, the food. You could have UV alien tattoos all over your body and not know. You gotta check. I have checked it with the UV flashlight. I've checked everything, guys. I don't think I have any secret alien tattoos. Trust me, bro. I don't have any tattoos. I promise. I'm not from Illuminati. But look at this triangle here. Why do you think I wear this backpack? Hmm? Just some food for thought.
Do you even have a lava lamp? No. Lava lamp, huh? I don't even probably have simple light bulbs in every room. What do you mean lava lamp? It's like, really you don't have light bulbs? I have light bulbs. Uh, these things go there and that's it ladies and gents. We have sorted out the inventory somehow, some way. Took us 84 years, but we did it. So give us that Area 51 pass to... To go and see your alien friends. Just reminder. Tactical armor and iron hatchets. Wait, do we need to craft iron hatchets as well? This raid... Yeah, this raid is crazy. This, uh, duct tape. Let's get wood. Iron and let's grab those hatchets and let's go for the raid today a little bit of a late live stream It's not really late. Is it really late there than usual? Maybe a half an hour later, but not really I used to stream way later So it's not really late 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 Nails gotta go there. Today's Friday, pizza day. Let's go. It's not a pizza day. I wish there was a pizza. A nice pizza here, but there are no nice pizzas. Uh, consumables. Unless I'll make a homemade one, but I didn't prepare the dough and the dough usually has to sit for at least a few hours or maybe a day. So yeah, there will be no pizza day today. Um, blocks, 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 ladies and gents. Let's go. This raid definitely took us a while to prepare to. Took a while to prepare. I'll also get a C4 from the base, and that's it. Let's just let's go for the second raid of the day. Let's see what this base has in store for us. If I had to guess, probably some scrap metal. Maybe some grass. Maybe, I don't know, some berries. No Sainsbury's or Pizza Hut close to you. There are no Pizza Huts here in Sainsbury's. Never heard of that. There is Domino's, but I'd rather eat bread than Domino's. Uh, I mean, it's not bad. Domino's is probably all right, but they charge a lot for pizza. All right, let's go through this door. There we go, ladies and gents. I've done enough research. Yeah. 
you have normal light bulbs. And now in 22, most of the people have LED bulbs. I have the, the, the candles. I'm still using candles. Wax, good old wax candles. Nothing useful in this chest so far, besides a little bit of leather and some thick cloth. Random question, but are you more of an HP fan or Lords of the Rings? HP means health points. I know that it means Harry Potter, but... Yeah. Harry Potter was kind of cool. I've watched Lords of the Rings, and some people go crazy about it. I don't think Lords of the Rings was bad, but I don't know what was all the fuss about it. Maybe I'll rewatch it one day. It was nice to look at. That's all I can say about Lords of the Rings. It was nice to look at. Let's get the AK. And is there anything else? We got one more chest, ladies and gents. I spent so much time trying to raid this base. And that's what we've got. Nothing. Goop, well, some carrots, uh, some beans and carrots as well. And that's it. Whatever. Let's get these things back to the base because we have a bookshelf. So I might as well just store those things there. But that is it. That is it, ladies and gents. This base. Does it get Sark's approval? Um, I don't know. This base does not get Sark's approval. Pretty bad base. Pretty terrible base. Candles? It's all about the torches. Well, I'm not that ancient. We have candles here. Torches? Are for the Stone Age. I'm very modern here. We use candles. There's a new Lord of the Rings show on Amazon this week, I think. Says Lila, maybe. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. What do, What I do know is that I recently have watched Lost in Space. And it was a pretty decent TV show. Like, I did enjoy it. I didn't expect to like it that much, but I think it's... It is... It was really fun to watch. It was interesting throughout. So if some of you are searching for a nice TV show to watch, I would maybe suggest watching The Lost in Space if you haven't started watching it yet, because I think it's kind of fun. Kind of alright. Uh, let's drop the electronic circuit. Wait, we're gonna give that electronic circuit to the Raiders. The electronic circuit, let's share it. I watched Lost in Space, it did get cancelled though. It didn't really get cancelled, like, there were three seasons. All I can say without spoilers, there were three seasons and they wrapped up everything. Like, they knew that they'll get cancelled, and I don't really think that they there was a need for the fourth season. Like, the TV show ended really nicely, it had a really nice ending to it. So... I don't think it needed a fourth ending, so it didn't feel like it got cancelled, you know? It's not like the Resident Evil Netflix TV show where it got cancelled in the middle of it. And we've gotten only one season. They had three seasons, but it wrapped up nicely, and... I'm happy with it. I don't regret watching it. It was really nice. So yeah, that's it, ladies and gents. We've raided another base. And we are done. So yeah, we'll be probably wrapping up this live stream as well. 
We'll be wrapping up the live streams. Really controversial question, man. What's better, YouTube videos or TV shows? Well, well, well. I like both. If I'm gonna find a nice YouTube channel, I'll just binge watch everything there. But I don't mind watching some nice TV shows as well. So yeah, we'll be wrapping it up, guys. Thanks for joining No Speed Cubing. Well, we can do one Speed Cubing. We can do it, guys. Last time we kind of messed up with times, so... Uh, speed Cube Timer. We can do one solve here. Again, I've practiced... Zero. I didn't practice at all here. Um, so let's warm up a bit. And let's try to solve one, one cube. Let's try to speed cube once. To those that have just joined, usually at the end of the live stream, sometimes we do some speed cubing. And we try to beat my previous records here. This, 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 and this. Joe Schmo, give Dogo food. Joe Schmo, thanks for the super chat, but I did give Dogo's food. What do you mean, give Dogo's food? They have food. Thanks for the super chat, but I gave them literally for a day worth of food. I mean, for Joe Schmo, we can give them another stack of, uh, another stack of, uh, turkey. I mean, not big of a deal, but I've literally just fed them. We literally just gave them an entire stack of food. They already had, like, look at this. Look at these things. They're full. Oops, wrong button. But yeah, they already had a uh, five hours worth of food, but hey, let's give them five more hours. Tomorrow, missed video. Sorry, yes, tomorrow there is a missed video. So yeah, tomorrow there is a miss video, and today we have, boom, the speed cube, right? So let's go, let's do some more random spins, and let's go for it. That's it, guys. We can do a little bit of inspection. There we go, I think. Three, two, one, we can start it. Kind of messed up a bit, but it do be like that. Got him. Got a bit lucky at the end. 41 second. Pretty epic. Pretty great, I'd say. Almost sub 30. I did get a bit lucky at the end and I did make a mistake here and there. Could have been a bit faster. But got also a bit lucky. So that's pretty epic. That's a pretty nice solve in my opinion. Alright, it was like this and then... Okay, that's it. So guys, we'll be wrapping it up. Thanks for joining. My guess of sub one day was accurate. Yes, indeed. So guys, take care, everybody. See you later. See you tomorrow with another Miss Survival video. And then after tomorrow, there is another last day on Earth live stream. Then probably the... Mm. Not the watchtower, but the thing, whatever it's called, uh, the highway is going to reset. So yeah, we'll go to the highway there once again. We'll also clear the sewers. We'll get some asbestos. So yeah, take care, everybody. And see you later, guys. Take care. Have fun. Have an amazing Friday. And take care, everybody. Take care, take care, guys. Take care. Take care, everyone.